Sellers rejoice! Amazon has finally actually done something nice for sellers for once, and it's something that everyone has been asking for for such a long time. Amazon finally introduced a custom analytics dashboard, and I am actually very impressed with this dashboard. So first and foremost, if you haven't already checked this out, you can do so by going up here, going to your reports, and then custom analytics. So what is custom analytics? Well, a couple of different things. We can either do a dashboard of our own, or start with a template. They have a couple of different ones right now. They have a Prime Day Recap template. They have a Coupon Deals Discounts Promotions template, sale and pricing, traffic and sales, so on and so forth. But it's actually really much better than that. And the reason it's better than that is because you have so many different things you can add in here for your tiles. You can have a table, you can have template files, you can have just so many different analytics. And the actual really cool part about this is that a lot of this is just much better than what I would say third parties are giving you. Most of what I'm seeing here is uh, overall just as good, if not better, than what most third party services are giving you as a whole. So Amazon giving this much data right off the bat is really, really interesting to me just from the aspect of they've never given this kind of information to sellers before. So I'm exceptionally excited about this opportunity for sellers to actually get an understanding across the board and also not have to worry about using third parties. Now, does this get rid of every single aspect of a third party reporting software in my opinion? No, but I think that this is a major step up for Amazon in general. It's just very, very late as to when they should have initially done this. This seems like something they definitely should have given us years and years ago. They've had all this data. They're just now giving us the ability to actually utilize it. So I think a lot of this is going to be really cool, especially being able to do uh, more custom dashboards. So if we're actually looking at this, creating a blank dashboard, we can actually do even as simple as a multi-year trend. So we can add a lot of different metrics in here, even at something as uh, monotonous as... I don't know, order count or late shipment rate, on-time delivery rate. So it doesn't matter if you are FBA or FBM, there are so many different things that we can add in to view. It is actually exceptional how many different areas Amazon has essentially allowed for us to be able to create new custom reports and analytics using this. So uh, I'm really, really excited about using this feature. I'm really excited to be able to start creating dashboards across the board for clients uh, as well as just on every single little facet that we want to see information on that Amazon now will allow us to actually view. So if you are excited about getting some custom analytics yourself, we're going to be releasing a small series here shortly going over how to build some of the more useful custom analytics that you should be tracking on your account. So if you want to stay tuned for that, feel free to like this video, subscribe, uh, and we will be posting those very soon.